All right, guys, we get the video started. I just want to say one, a couple things. I'm safe. I was not. I wasn't injured. You know, car flipped. It's what hap it's happened. I had no hard feelings against Uncle Chet. You know, he's a really cool guy. Like I said he was so he felt so bad about it, and I was like, I got to tell him, like, dude, it's okay, it's okay, it's racing. You know, you're safe. I'm safe. It's all that matters. You know, it's all that matters in the end. The drivers are safe, and no one's you know seriously hurt and going to the hospital with serious injuries. The safety the safety equipment worked, and everyone walked out unscathed from it. So. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I had lots of fun. Please tell you guys if you want to subscribe to the channel, I would really highly appreciate it. Um, other than that, like I said, enjoy the video. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Well, today is actually a race day. Got a lot to work. A lot of work to do. We got to cut the exhaust. Um, we're gonna be probably swapping tires with one guy. See if that helps us increase our time and stuff. Um, I'm gonna go get an air filter for the car. Um, what else am I gonna do? I gotta do an oil filter. I gotta adjust all my mirrors and restraints and all that stuff so I'm more comfortable. Let me see what I got. Let me see what I got on my list. <coughs> uh, deactivate my airbags. Measure. I gotta measure the tires still. Um, um, I'm gonna order. I'm gonna order two tires. They're a little smaller than my tire, just to um, have on side. But we'll see how it works in the end. Um, but yeah, that's all we gotta do. Not, not, not too much, it's just a bunch of little stuff that just gonna you know, take some time up. Um, but we're gonna go ahead to uh, AutoZone, get the filter, maybe some spark plug, I'm not sure yet. Um, <coughs> and then um, after I do that, go ahead, I think the, the track opens up at 9, well the pit open, opens at 9, so we'll go in the pit. Um, say hi to a couple guys we met, and then um, yeah, everybody should get to work, get the car going. And I'll keep you guys updated on the truck and I'll we'll work on it. I'm trying to cut the exhaust off here. I, I wish I could get this cow converter off, but that will not work. Because that O2 sensor is right there, so I can't just unbolt it. Uh, if I take the O2 sensor off, then most likely it won't run right, so. <coughs> so I might be stuck with it the way it is right here. But, with that being said, maybe I can uh, unbolt the, the whole thing after I get this cut. Unbolt it from up there. And I can cut it actually off the this calibrator here off this one side. So, so we got a couple people. We got a couple new people out here. People, person over there. A couple guys rolling in right now actually. But other than that, I'm doing some work on here trying to get this exhaust pipe off as quick as possible. And you know, try to get this thing ready. Not much to do like I said, but just a bunch of little stuff. All right, guys, we're in tech right now. Waiting for tech. There's Donnie. I think that's Jack Stan's car. I think he's really racing that thing, but it'd be funny if he actually really does. I think it really is though. I don't know. But um yeah, we got a tech card. Waiting for a tech right now. It's gotta go pass inspection and we're good to race. Alright guys, truck pass inspection or tech we won't call it. So we're good on that part. Um my friends get me my stuff here so I can get my air my out filter in. Uh ha hacks all the underneath here off. We got we got something to grind it down here. Just got to hacks all the rest of this stuff up up here because that's too tight for the grinder. So, chop off, chop there, chop off there, and we set to go on that part. So, see what we get, get when we get there. All right, guys, I got the truck tested here. Um, spun out with these tires. I don't. I think I'm gonna put the big ones back on here because um, this just doesn't give me what I need um, traction wise and speed wise. It just doesn't match up. I just feel like it didn't match up. I didn't like the way it was handling. So. Throw a big goes back on it. Yeah, I wasn't much faster. We need to put a new gear in this to get really faster and we don't have time for that. So maybe next year we'll do a lot more work on this truck. Keep it in one piece for next year. <laughs> so we're going back to the bigger tires on the back. And then, you know, we're, we, uh, we're, probably, get, we're probably getting class B. There's A and B, so what we'll do is hopefully A and B, but then B is like the first 10 people in the class, the 10 winners are going to go to the A class. So gonna do that uh hopefully we can get we can get to two races because then more footage more you know we'll be out there more um and racing just get more experience so and more for experience so that's more what i'm looking for so at least get the experience of racing and you know have have a good time that's what this is all about <laughs> all right guys that's the qualifying so let's see how we can make this work
gonna win, right? Yep, gotta That's win. Awesome. Only way. Out there, right? Yep. Thanks, man. Yes. Fever good? Yeah, it was working You're up going before. 2.4 hours of the bullets. So, right, good. Let's see. Uh, B Bank and LS George maybe pull it off? Or Buenos Dias? Or you think James is going to? Alright, so this is the beginning of the race. Basically, I didn't record the beginning. I don't know why my GoPro didn't record, but it did. So this is the beginning right here. Someone spun out not too far along this. It got a little look in the right corner towards the end of like this segment. But watch those two white trucks. The one will uh, spin out and do a little flip. Um, but right after that, then you get the GoPro footage inside the car and everything, and be good to go there. And I'm gonna talk through where all this just so gives a little extra entertainment. Instead of just watching like a just cars go around in a circle, circle. So it started raining actually right after the caution when the girl flipped. Um, then the girl behind me that was right, her sister. I think she, uh, someone said that she got like anxious and had to get out. Just she just it kind of dramatized a little bit watching her sister flip and stuff like that or seeing it. She said. Um, so she wasn't there anymore, so I was basically in the back of the pack. Um, my car was way too slow to be doing this, like, um, it just wasn't geared right. I don't know if it's just a truck, it throws me too a little bit. There's some mistakes I have watching this. I've made a couple, a couple of them that could have actually passed some people. Um, but other than that, um, the big tire, the big tire, not just kind of helped with the rain here, because, like, the piece spun out. I was able to hit the torque. I probably could have hit a little harder, but, um, like I said, at, at this point, I was trying to just try to learn the car still. So this is this after our caution. Uh, basically, we started up again. We started going, going, going. I didn't think at this point I think I was battling someone. Yeah, the the, the cop car I was battling. Uh, Saying so he kept trying to pass. Um, I wouldn't let him pass. Um, anything else happened here? I don't know if anything else happened here. But you know, just kind of just you know, feeling the car out still more. Get, I'm starting to get more. I'm starting to get a lot more comfortable with the car in the rain. So here I, I kind of get a little ballsy with some things later on. Uh, that third, that one truck right in front, I think he's the one, he was spinning a lot, he was like twisting around, spinning. Actually, I think right here we're about to see, nope, 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 not this turn, not this turn. But, um, I see it was just me and this guy, we're just here going back and forth. Alright, so this is the one where he started ACA, you know what, he almost spun out, it gave me the advantage to hit the gas and get in front of him. Like I said, my car wasn't geared right, so my car just kept shifting more than going. So it, my car wasn't in the power band it should have been to really kick in front of people. So I don't know how fast I was going. I can look at my speedometer here. My hand's in the way. I'm guessing it's, it's around 40 to 50 miles per hour. All right, so this is actually where I had the ravine. This one guy we're battling. Actually, this guy was next to me in the pits. One guy over. Uh, he was pretty cool. He let me install. So on this turn here, I got a little cocky with the turn, and I felt the back end turn slide as I hit the brakes a little bit. This turn I got a little too cocky and kind of had it slowed down a little bit and then he got in front and then the guy next to me, behind me, next to me got in front. So here I kind of lost two positions. But I later on gained them back, so it wasn't too bad.
race is over right here, so now I'm, you know, I'm just trying to figure out if I wanted to pay me. I was very quiet, I was like, did I get it? Did I get it? Yes, we did it! So, so right here is a top 10 people went to A-Main. So. We did it, just did it! I was very excited that we got it done. How are you feeling right now? <laughs> Quite good. Figuring things out. Got it's into A main. A main. I say, I guess got to figure. The truck's very slow, but I got traction. So I'm not being a lot of people do do the traction. Compare. So at this point, I didn't really know if I was an A main. I heard them say I was an A main, but everyone kept saying, "Are you sure you're an A main?" No one said anything about any. I'm like. I'm pretty sure it's a what. So I'm like, no, I'm like, well, there. They tell me get off the track, then you know, I get off the track. But, yep. but yeah, so got on here. They already worked out. You know, popped pop me up. It's about to begin here. Um, I was just about to start catching up to the guy, and then I saw the light turn green. Like, oh shoot, too late now. All right, well, let's hit the gas. Let's go. So, so I go back to the me, blah, blah, blah. I stuck myself right down and stopped the whoever or anything else was there. I was supposed to target to it, I can't, it just wouldn't go, you know, so, 
I was more for it for just having fun for the race and I was really like, yeah. So at and a chat I think. But um but yeah, so we went for the ride, I was enjoying I was trying to just playing around with racing, you know, how it feels and stuff, like, you know, how to corner around the thing around me. So it was right, it was, it was a good experience I'll say. Very good experience. Alright guys, so the clip you want to see is coming up soon, so listen, the, the clip is given to me from uh, Let's Race, that's his YouTube channel, um, as I became friends at the race, um, but he was right behind us when it happened, so he got the full on exactly what happened, and you guys see a little bit of what exactly happened, because there was like almost no footage out there of this. Alright guys, I just got done editing the video, not done editing, but this is the outro for the video, for the race video. Um, but I just want to show you guys the truck real quick for the ending of the video. Uh, so I'm back home, um, but here's the truck. The truck's pretty good. She got hit pretty good. You know, she still runs, still everything's perfectly fine with that. Ah, sorry about the interruption, but um, man, so the truck has it like to just hit. This whole thing here dented in, and inside of here is like, you know, it's just dented like literally to the max. So uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do with the truck yet exactly. I'm gonna make a separate video on like, you know, pulling open his hood up, seeing what damages are inside, if the right ear cracked, did the reservoir just leaked out. Um but so whole actual update video I'll do it separately than this. Um but other than that, I'd say I'm safe, I'm good. I didn't get hurt, I didn't even have soreness, I really thought I was gonna wake up sore the next day. I didn't, I didn't text uh, Uncle Chet. I, like, I was like, yo, how are you feeling? And he's like, he said he had like his hurt shoulder and stuff, but it was good. He was good to go and things. And uh, so, so, so nobody got majorly hurt in it. I said, right after, after like the accident, I didn't know that he flew into the wall. I just thought he, someone hit me, which was him. I found out and I thought they hit me, you know, they were good. Like, you know, usually have people like, you know, they hit someone and they, they kind of like veer off and then wherever it goes. But, um, but no, he apparently hit me right in the back and he flew right into the wall. And I was like, Jesus. But I said, I didn't know that. Like I said, when it all happened, <coughs> when it happened, like I said, everything went slow motion. Like, you know, like when anything happens to you, just go slow motion. I just felt the truck twisting, twirling, doing all these things. I'm like, hey, this, this brace for impact was just, you know, it's it's coming. So I didn't feel any big bangs. Like I said, I didn't, I didn't, I heard a big bang, but I didn't feel it. So, but I heard it. I was like, that didn't sound good. And then landed. I was like, oh, I'm on all fours. I'm like, all right, let's go. Let's, let's start racing this thing. And then, then they're like, stop this up. Like, they're like, tell me, like, turn the car off, stop the car, blah, blah. And I started off. I looked to the right. I go, oh my God. I'm like, I didn't know that happened. And then, blah, blah. And then, and blah. And I was like, well, that sucks. And then, after like, after I looked over, I saw them all running at me. And then I'm like, I'm just like, oh, shoot. I'm like, there's nothing. I'm, I think I'm sure that I'm okay. I'm like, put my thumbs like, yep, I'm good, dude. This got, I'm good. They're running up. And I'm, <laughs> I was like the first that was also like one of the first things I did besides look at that was just like make sure to put my thumb up like yo I'm okay don't like no don't don't you're on the rush I'm, I'm fine I'm not I'm not injured I'm not I'm good so uh, they got to the car blah blah like took the harness off you know the my window my window now on the other side is all um like the bar itself that move, uh, comes on on and off is jammed up there so she's stuck in there glad, glad, glad I know my welds are pretty good um but that's all Jenna, so luckily the vent slides, so I was able to get out of the area, open the door, slide it open, and Kate jumped out of there. And like I said, I didn't know, I didn't know Chet, um, we call it, crashed into the wall. I didn't know that until like, when I got up there. And I'd say one word. 
But other than that, I said they were just they were trying to rush me into the medics. They were just trying to like get me checked out. Cletus uh, drove up. I don't know if he was calling me over. I just saw him go like this, and I was I thought he called me over. I, I heard him say, it, it, <coughs> "Is he okay? Or are you okay?" And I was like, I looked over. I'm like, "Do I go over there?" I'm like, "I'll oh, just go over there." And just count. I, I, he's looking over at me. I was like, "All right, let's go over." So I went over to him. I don't know. I, was, I don't know. If he, I don't remember what he said. I just like, the adrenaline was rushing at that point. So I was like, "Yeah, I'm good. I'm good." I'm like, you know, just we. I did a nice little flip. I said, but I'm all good. And then they're like, all right, let's go. You gotta get, you gotta get out of here. Like not to play to me, like saying you gotta get to the medic. And they're trying to find a vehicle for me. I don't know where the vehicles were at, but they're like, hey. they're like, oh, nope, nope, not that vehicle. And then like the one guy comes up, he's like, go get in this car. I'm like, all right. So I jumped in one of those things, and he's, the guy's driving. I'm like, dude, this thing's awesome. Like this thing has some pickup. And then, blah blah. He's like, yeah. And then the guys, it was okay. I'm like, yeah, it's okay. And then he's like, he's like, dude, are you actually okay? I'm like. I'm like, yeah. And I'm like, was it really that bad? He's like, dude, you went flying in the air. I'm like, really? I'm like, I didn't, I, honestly, dude, I have, I just, I was really, I literally went for the ride. That's what I kept saying. I'm like, I just, it just went for the ride. No, it couldn't do anything. I just went for the ride and I landed and I was like, wow. And then, yeah, then, then that's when I, I ran to Uncle Chet going to like, when they were pulling me over to the medics and uh, medic van and they're like, I saw him there. He's saying, I'm sorry. I'm like, He's like, I'm the one to hit you. I'm like, oh, I'm like, oh, dude, it's all right. I'm like, you're good. I'm like, you're safe. And he's like, yeah. I'm like, it's like, I'm safe. All right, we're good. I'm like, that's all that matters in this. No hard feelings, nothing there. Just as long as we're all safe and we're good to go, that's then we move on our lives. You know, it's racing. You get hurt. You get you get into accidents like this. Sometimes it's small. Sometimes it can be, it can be worse than this. This could have been much worse. It could have crushed my entire windshield down on, almost onto me. Could have crushed the other side of the car right where I was at. And not that this would have probably would have hit me, but it would have been closer than I would have liked to be really. But you know, but it could have been much worse. You always have to look at the bright side of things. So I always put it. So look at the bright side. But other than that, the experience of driving down there was awesome. I loved it. I'll do it again. I'll do it a hundred times over. So, but I'm gonna end the video off here. Um, the videos are long enough, so listen, guys. I'll do more of an update video on this truck in the next coming days. So, if you guys enjoyed the video, please like down below, comment down below what you guys think about the race and everything. Subscribe to the channel, support the truck, you know, help us. We're probably gonna do a rebuild on it, so you can watch that and we have more racing with the drag, the drag car over here soon. So, if you guys want to see the adventure of oval racing and drag racing, then subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys in the next one.